to our mother Alice Pelpelman from her four children. We love you, dear mother. Your life is complete. You love us back greatly. God made you so sweet. Your life was not easy at times. We were bad, but you just ignored that. Such a warm heart you had. A former wife works out from morning to night. Daily and milking, you help do it right. You fed us with breakfast, our mouth were a pit, and dinner and supper we ate every bit. The housework was endless, our clothes came out clean. We never said thank you, were we really that mean? Your life's greatest tragedy, the early death of our dad, it broke your heart greatly, we saw you so sad. That life-changing moment affected us all, but your life changed most. You endured a great fall. God saw our dilemma, your smile did return. We thank him most dearly, he saw our concern. Now, now our life continues with hearts that are blue. We miss you so dearly, may God help us too. A poem to Alice and Irvin. Today we lift a Christian chalice to a friend and mother whom we all call Alice, David, Melvin, Marilyn, and Gary. We're the children she brought up out on the farm prairie. Through thick and thin, she wore some grins because she knew she always had her twins. And we all thought Alice could keep her urban, but God said no, he had a grander, grander plan. God said, urban is mine, I only take the best. We all said no, but it was useless to protest. So on we went each to find our way in hopes to make our mother and father proud of us today. David, Melvin, Marilyn, and Gary Pelvin, March 2nd, 2012. Okay, now can you show us the two poems, please? Okay, and separate them apart. Okay, and then this one comes with a Three Musketeers bar. Okay. So now, which one do you like better, mine or David's? Yours. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.